All right, well, Friday is finally here, and that, of course, means it's Foodie Friday here on Take Two. And today we're checking out Jersey Mike's newest location here in Hawaii. The chain is known for both their grilled sub sandwiches and community support. Yeah, so let's rejoin Jai, who's live from Pearl City. Jai, we heard they're helping out disaster relief here in Hawaii as well. So awesome. So tell us all about it. You know what? It is the sixth. I didn't know this. It's the sixth Jersey Mike's to open here in Hawaii. We're in the Pearl Highlands, and you can't miss it. They are sort of right front and center. I wanted to find out more, and and the staff and crew are already up and going this morning. And I wanted to take a look. Check this out. Hey, there they are. And you know what the great thing about Jersey Mike's is? They're all smiling. So obviously, it's a very good place to work. And you know what the great thing is? Look at the ingredients. This stuff is fresh, and I know that's something Jersey Mike's takes a great deal of pride in. I want to introduce you to George Hernandez. He is the uh, uh, general manager for here. Franchisee, and general manager, director of operations. Uh. George, you got the crew working very busy. Yes. Tell me about Jersey Mike's subs. What makes it such a unique and special restaurant when it comes to getting a good sandwich? I think uh, it's uh, the culture of Jersey Mike's has been since 1956 to slice fresh. Every single cold sub and grill every single hot sub. And we top it up with the uh, Mike's Way, which is onion, lettuce, tomatoes, oh. red wine vinegar, olive oil, blend it to perfection, and then we bake the bread every day fresh. I was that's what say, makes it special. I was going to say, that's the thing that you guys take a great deal of pride in. Everything you see is literally just been cut, just been cooked. I mean, it is fresh. That's 100% correct. We even uh, the trim tie the roast beef every single day. So when you order a roast beef sandwich, you get it fresh every day. You know, the bread, the cookies, um, everything's done fresh every day. So. And ladies, don't worry. The subs they're making right now are all coming back to the TV station. George, if you don't mind, real quick, uh, just open. Tell me a little bit about what's going to be happening with proceeds and how you guys are helping the uh, Hawaii chapter of the American Red Cross. Yes. Yeah, so we just opened. So we're going to do uh, uh, five days of uh, uh, giving back to a community. So every person that comes in with the card. They get a free sub, they donate $2 for that sub, and all that money is going to go to American Red Cross of Hawaii. So we're really proud to do that and help them out. George, let me real quickly step in between you because I know this lady appreciates it greatly. <laughs> I do, and what Jersey, And what Jersey Mike's is doing for you. Yes. What this means, because it, it's not just... We have seen how literally of the Hawaii chapter of the American Red Cross has to stretch across the state yes. because you're helping everyone from Hawaii Island all the way to the North Shore of Kauai. And we've been going 10 weeks straight um, with the floods and the lava and every four days in Hawaii. So we are incredibly grateful to George and, um, and this organization for um, allowing their customers to spread their aloha and their, and their compassion to disaster victims, including those that are suffering from the Puna Lava Flow. I know that you guys work hand in hand with a number of different organizations, but when someone like a Jersey Mike's comes in, isn't that great? Uh, this is the sixth location, but you can totally tell that this company has put down roots here. They want to be here. They truly, uh, as George was saying, we got to we got to change the the name now. He's not George. He's actually Kaoki. <laughs> yes, it's Kaoki. No, we really appreciate um, Jersey Mike's and and all of the co community coming together. And by having them help us, they're helping the community. So we really appreciate them. Well, Corley, congratulations. Thank you. And Kaoki. Thank you very much. Hey, if you don't mind, I'm going to stick around a little bit. Is it possible for me to maybe get a little training and see if I could actually be sort of uh, Jersey Mike's material? Of course. You could, we could do that and help you out. Maybe you'll work here for us part time. How's that? <laughs> there we go. And you know what? I would be helping not just Jersey Mike's. I could eat and I could help out the American Red Cross Hawaii go. chapter. Thank you very much. We appreciate that. Let's head back in the Take Two studio. Ladies, can you believe how quickly the staff works out here? That's incredible. And oh, those sandwiches look so good. Mm -hmm. And he did say that he'll bring some back, right? He did. I heard correctly. Okay. As long as it's not just his that he's bringing back. I want to try the one named me. <laughs> oh, no Jai, offense. you got to eat, eat what you make. Yeah, no <laughs> offense, Jai. Well, a very popular way to raise funds for an important cause is through food. And that rings true for a new sandwich shop in Pearl City. That's right. Jersey Mike Subs is celebrating the new location by giving back, which is so awesome. So let's check back in with Jai on this Foodie Friday. So, Jai, how are they helping cook up some disaster relief funds? And I hear you're going to be cooking something up, too. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I, I decided that I'm going to leave it to the experts. And these folks here wearing the hats, they're the experts. So we're going to leave them. You know what the neat thing is, is you can see the staff actually putting together. The, the great thing about this is everything, and you can tell 
how fresh everything is. And hey, as you guys were saying, it is benefiting uh, the local community. I want to introduce Coralie Matayoshi. Uh, she is the president and CEO of American Red Cross, Hawaii your uh, chapter. Hey, good morning, Coralie. Yeah. If you don't mind, Jersey Mike's, this is their sixth location. Mm -hmm. They, for five days, are having sort of a giving campaign where they can help you guys out. Yeah. What that means to you as a corporation for them yeah. to really sort of say, yes, we're here in Hawaii mm -hmm. and we love Hawaii. It is so heartwarming to see Jersey Mike's come into the Hawaii market and immediately make a difference and we sure need their help because we we just respond to disasters every four days and we've been 10 weeks straight with the floods and now the lava which we don't get an end in sight so we are incredibly grateful for companies like this that just come into the market and make a difference. Coralie thank you very much thank I appreciate you. it and I know you're a busy lady she's already off for a conference call hey Kiyoki Hernandez I, I dubbed him Kiyoki because now he is uh, he's Hawaiian if you don't mind tell me what makes Jersey Mike's been since 1956. Six. What makes it such a special place when it comes to ordering a sub? Well, come this way, I'll show you a little bit about it. So we have the meat caves, and we had this since 1956. We put our meats here, and every sub that you get, you get it Mike's way, all fresh. We have the Coca-Cola, uh, red pepper ham, we have the salami, we have the ham, we have the turkey, the provolone cheese. So when you order a cold sub, the gentleman here will slice it fresh from here slice it right there, and they'll top it off Mike's Way. Mike's Way is our signature way of topping it, which is onion, lettuce, tomatoes, red wine vinegar, olive oil, and uh, blend it to perfection. Oh. And I tell you what, we see the ladies over on the grill working. It's not just cold subs. You also have a number of different hot subs you offer up as well, right? And if I'm not mistaken, are they working on a big kahuna? That's correct. They're working on number 56. Every sub has a name and a number. Oh. We're gonna on the big kahuna grilled onions, peppers, mushrooms, jalapenos, and extra cheese. Ooh. And it's all grilled fresh every day. Okay, so uh, Kelly, if you heard that, then when you come into Jersey Mike's, order the 56. That's the one you want. Uh, that's the big kahuna, if I'm not mistaken, right? That's correct. Big kahuna cheesesteak. Okay, number, can't sir. go wrong with that. Okay, so if you don't mind, George Kioki, besides this. I guess how it feels to be in this market. You guys are reaching out to American Red Cross, helping them out. Why is that important for you? Because you said this is company-wide. This is not just something that's being done here at Pearl Highlands, but this is something that the company truly embraces. Yeah, there's been uh, like this since 1956. Uh, CEO Peter Kankro, the founder, he started this where we give back to the communities. So Jersey Mike's, what they do is uh, every month, uh, uh, in the month of March, we give back to a nonprofit organization. This year, uh, the company raised six million dollars to uh, 170 nonprofit charities across the country. Since 2010 to present, they, we, you know, the company has raised 34 million dollars. That's what's important for us to embrace that, because that's part of the culture, it's part of the, what we do to reach out to the community and help them out. Well, I tell you what, George, it's a good job. And you must be pretty thrilled with these young people because oh, it seems like you got yourself a great crew. Oh, the crew is amazing. I mean, they do this with a passion, and, you know, we're a sub above company. Everything is done fresh. They love what they do, and they do it naturally. As you can see, how they topped it off, Mike's Way right there. That is Mike's Way, which is the onions, lettuce, tomatoes. Then you got that special spices that's put on there. And, and the, juices. the juices. That's what makes the Jersey Mike's. Red wine vinegar, olive oil, blend it to perfection. It's right there. George Kiyoki Hernandez, thank you, John. thank you very much. We appreciate you and appreciate your staff. And then, uh, yes, just to let you ladies know, this is what's headed back towards the station. So, yeah, the Take Two crew is going to be well taken care of. Thanks to Kiyoki and his staff out here at Jersey Mike's. It's the sixth location, Pearl Highlands. That's where you can find them open every day, seven days a week. All right, let's head back in the Take Two studio. Thanks so much, Jai. I don't think they trusted him to make a sandwich, no. but I think good good choice on their part. And, and then I, we get a good sandwich. I've tried them before. They're also Nililani. Okay. Go hungry because yeah. it's huge and it's really tasty very well. Yeah. Very good. Yeah. Ooh, I'm excited.